Hello chaps, another update for it, second update for you on my Airfix 172, Airfix 176 scale Churchill, Churchill, second update for you on my Airfix 176 scale Churchill Crocodile Tank Mark 7, that is my third and final entry into Russ Gosling's D-Day group build, uh, D-Day group build, that is my final entry into Russell Gosling's D-Day group build, uh, before I do the old update, the second update, user vision of Shannon to Mod Pro, 72 Lenny, Mod Pro, 72, basic, mod basic modelling, Aaron Newlands, um, Aaron Newlands, uh, Atomic Dog 32, Alex Modeling, uh, Kalido 1, um, Shane Highland making models again, Mark O'Neill, Mark O'Neill, uh, Nigel Wells, Cohen C, uh, Waterloo 745, Warren Blanche, Lon757, That's Guy, Inspiretech, RASDV, Callum Wilding, Master HQ, Devon Tom, Mr. Z Kits, AZ Kits, Andrew Coins, Andy Model, Airfix Freak, Mr. Morsier, S, uh, uh, Golden Eagle, Trainboy220, uh, Child James Day, James Dival64, Child Modeler, uh, Child Modeler, Crazy Kit Builder, Crazy Modeler, Hobby Modeler, UK Scale Modeler, Mr. Great Models, Do Look to Update, Paul Marsh, and you know, sorry, that's maybe Dan, Max, Merrin, Ellie, Amelia, Kelsey, Kira, Chloe, Mum, Hayley, Billy, June, Greg, Lynn, Lenny, Ashley, Ashley, Alex, Alex, Andrew, Gavin, George, Tom, Tristan, John, Joe, Sam, Caroline, Luke, Lisa, Lucy, Louis, Debbie, Diggs, Nan, Nico, and Charlotte speak to you soon. Right, Churchill, update for you, chaps. Right, as you can now see, I've now attached both the drive sprockets, both the both the drive sprockets and the road wheels to the uh, to the to the um, to the right inner armor plating. Um, they all went in fine. All the wheels went in fine. No problems in terms of steps or gaps. Uh, a lineage wise in terms of all the in terms of this part, in terms of that, in terms of the wheels on this side being on this on in the front of the front, alignment wise not all the the wheels aren't all in line. But in but though anyway there were no in terms of fitting into these little pegs there's no steps or gaps for that matter and just so you know paint wise all that on there is 1 8 is 86 like olive that is all 86 like olive same for the wheels and same for these plates for the actual whole, the whole turret plate there So that's that one. So that's the right one. That's the right one. And then this is the left one. This is the left one. Pretty much all the same. Pretty much all. All pretty much. I'm not going to go over what I've did again. It's pretty much all the same pretty much the same thing for the two for the two so yeah I'll just give you a good look at both so yeah they're the two track uh, so yeah they're, that's the two they're the two things that they're the two um, inner plating in a whole in the whole side platings with the with the road wheels and the sprockets with the road wheels and the sprockets attached that's pretty much all I've got for the update for, that's all I've got for now update wise um, I'll see the next one the next update won't be till I've um, joined the track together 
Um, for that, I am trying to. I'm going to try two. I'm going to try one method. One, the method that you suggested, Cohen, of on my tiger when um, that you suggested when I was doing my tiger of super gluing the tracks together. Failing that, it'll be the old Tamiya tape job. So you'll just have to wait and see on that one because I can't guarantee what what it will be. So till the next vid, which I don't know when it will be. So I don't know when I'll be joining the track when, the, when I'll have the tracks joined. Till the next video, basically it's all I need to be said. All I need to say is paint on your hands and face, glue on your hands and face. Don't know parents, be good for them, have fun modelling, and I'll see you guys on the next vid, which I don't know when it'll be. So till then, I'll see you guys later. All right, bye, gentlemen. Bye, bye, gentlemen. Bye, 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 bye. Bye.